express my sincere thanks to the media persons who used to support Jammu University always. And this time also, in the early morning, I would say for media people, 11.30 is the early morning, but you have come for this press conference at a very short notice. So on behalf of Jammu University, I express my sincere thanks once again to all of you. And also I appreciate the organizing committee who is organizing this Women's Science Congress on the day of International Day for Women and Girls in Science. And uh, the objective of this has been categorically explained by Professor Anju Bhashin, Professor Jyoti, and others. I would say that yatra nari pujayante ramante tatra deyota Hamara wo desh hai jahaan nari ko is roop se dekha jata hai aur I would differ with that that discrimination I would not say discrimination but no doubt Indian Science Congress as well as the Indian Academy of Sciences, Bangalore, a few years back, decided to promote the women scientists in India. Whether the fellowship for that is concerned, whether the INSA, Indian National Science Academy Fellowship, National Academy of Sciences, NASI Fellowship, or NAS Fellowship, or Indian Academy of Sciences Fellowship. So a special emphasis is being given in India to promote the women scientists. The objective that has been categorically specified also the, is that to dissolve the boundaries of the subjects. The Department of Geology is organizing or uh, biotechnology is organizing or botany or biochemistry or physical sciences, chemical sciences, this time we have dissolved that boundaries so that a platform would be provided to the young researchers, girls, to share their ideas and to see that what is going on in other departments, how they can collaborate with each other. Not only that, dissolving the boundaries of the subject, we are also trying to dissolve the boundaries of the institutions. So one institution can collaborate with another institution. So the idea of having this Science Congress is to provide the platform to the young researchers so that they can collaborate with the other institutions, they can collaborate with the other departments. And this is the objective of having this Women Science Congress. And also I appreciate and express my sincere thanks to Science and Technology Jammu and Kashmir for extending all support to the University of Jammu to organize such a Congress. Function 3 din ka hai, 11, 12, 13 February ka aur is function ko inaugurate kar rahe hai humare Honorable Lieutenant Governor Shriman Manoj Sinha ji aur usme guest of honor hai Professor Viva Tandon, she is heading the Indian Institute of Chemical Biology as a director. And in these three days, there are different sessions, in which there are paper presentation, poster presentation, and panel discussion. So, major focus is given on panel discussion, so that the most of the participants would find the opportunity to share their ideas also and, and to exchange their views also to address the problem of the society.